Hey guys, welcome. Uh, really quick, this is the NECA one quarter scale P1, the newer version. And um, I wanted to show you a mod that I do once in a while with the one six scale. But I saw this and I said, you know what, let me try this. So uh, I'm not reviewing the figure, but listen, if you can get a chance to pick one up, this is awesome. Uh, a couple of things here and there, of course, like always, you know, you nitpick. That's part of the uh, collecting, you know, you're always not going to find it totally flawless. But um, if you don't have a one quarter scale pred, this one's, you know, this one is uh, relatively uh, easy to obtain. That, you know, cost effective is awesome instead of paying, you know, fucking three, four, five thousand, hundred bucks. You can't beat it, man. And of course, because it's the newer P1, it comes with two lighted areas which is terrific one here the aim point device and the detonator or the laser sight you know for the cannon it's fucking sick so uh definitely get your hands on one of these if you're a pred fan so anyway let me show you what i did i'm gonna lay him down here and uh what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna show you the pred comes the p1 comes the NECA with two hands the left and right this is actually the right hand and then they give you this fisted closed hand. Okay, so you can see there. So what I did was I drilled it out. I've done this with my one six scale stuff. So it's just to add something to the hand. It's pretty cool. And especially one chord scale, you definitely have a lot more meat, more area to drill through. So I'll just show you really quick. I'm not gonna show you the process. I'm gonna show you the process already done, but how I went about it. So let me uh, move the camera a little bit set it up here so you guys can see that let me uh, zoom it up a little bit good let me take off this mask lower a little bit the music here in the background and uh, let's get to work so here's the hand I mean here's the arm excuse me for you techies you know you correct me really quick so we're gonna pull this out Nice and easy. I use this rag, and and then this head came from uh, a keychain from a biker store. I love skulls, so I had this around. I'm like, you know what? This will be perfect. So I take a drill. Now I would advise you, if you were gonna do this for the first time, you're not really familiar with drilling uh, things, and it's really easy. But I would start with a smaller drill bit, the diameter. And I'm going to show you with my hand what I, where are you going to have to try to drill. Okay, so you don't want to get a big bit and drill through here, okay? Because you're going to take away the thumb, you'll take away the you know the the uh, uh, point point finger, so it'll be just a mess. You want to get right in here, so you st hey, get your mind out the gutter. All right, so you're going to start right in here. You're going to go straight through. Now, because this hand is in, is uh, it's closed, you're going to feel like if you go in there, you're going to mess something up. But no, you won't mess anything up. You're going to go straight through, and you go right to the other side, and there should be no problems, okay? That's how it's going to look. You start with a smaller diameter. Believe me, trust me, you guys will be okay with that and it'll be a breeze, all right? And then you reverse the drill bit, take it out. Now you're gonna get some particles and no problem, you get a, a nose plier, or a micro nose plier and you pull out whatever excess that's in there and on the end here you clean it up nicely and you should have a beautiful hole, Oops, sorry, beautiful hole there. Or you can put a staff, insert whatever you want to insert make it look different you know what i'm saying then what i did was got the keychain going and what i'm going to do here is i'm going to take a uh, a micro screwdriver for my micro set and i'm going to put one end in there it doesn't have to be this long it could be a chain it could be whatever the hell you want it could be an actual weapon i have a very large one six scale sword you can cut off the piece and adapt it to the back. You can hold it like a knife, you know. Uh, 
the pinhead pinhead knife kitchen knife the neck of one quarter scale pinhead has the same thing and they did like a hole there and they and you can put it right in there you know just open this up a little bit and use gradually one drill bit at a time start very small work your way up until you get to the right circumference that you're able to fit whatever it is that you want to fit into the hand now a lot of people uh may be a little skeptical about this but man i'm gonna show you right now how it looks you know with something in the hand it just gives it a different a different um look which is what we want sometimes you know you want something unique in your collection and you know different than anyone else's look at that you, like a little noose you know huh, it's cool and uh I, I just use this for for the demonstration guys so you know maybe i'll get this out to my boy brian and brian will bloody it up you know you tighten it up a little bit you insert it into the hole you know here into into the uh wrist area now with NECA you gotta you gotta give it friction and friction causes heat and that makes it softer and that's how you get shit inside when I heard people talking about their one quarter scale um, you know the new alien and they can't put the pipes in the back I'm like are you really are, are you not a kid or what you should know this shit already how long you've been playing with this stuff <laughs> but anyway I'm gonna stand them up here and you can actually see him holding that skull looks fucking awesome I'm gonna turn it around here so you guys can take it actually take a better look at it on my monitor here let me get let me get into the black and uh, you guys will love this man this is really fucking cool can't beat it you may see my face but don't worry about it so there it is he's holding it's right there by his side. How, how does that look, man? It looks sick. Can you take a look at that? That's pretty cool. All right. Just looks beastly, man. Love it, man. So that's it. Quick mod for your one quarter scale NECA P1, man. And a review will come up one day soon. Not gonna get crazy, but man, this is a badass piece. I love this. You know how I always say it? I know you don't like me, but you like my style. Peace.